the Duchess of Sussex joined her fellow royals at their Royal Air Force centenary flypast at Westminster Abbey this morning, where the 36-year-old sat with her legs crossed, a way of sitting which has been chastised by royal experts as disrespectful. Slipping one leg over the other and leaning them to one side, an act that has given Meghan the nickname Duchess Slant, has been referred to as the Sussex sit by etiquette expert William Hansen. Mr. Hansen told the Daily Mail that historically, the American would have broken rules by doing this in historical times. He said, although used to be the custom that ladies, royal or non-royal, would never cross their legs, clearly the Duchess of Sussex is finding her own style, and comfortable seating position by crossing her legs. Correctly, however, she is not letting there be too much of a gap between her ankles, which can look very ungainly when done by women or men. The Duchess of Sussex faced criticism for sitting in the same manner, at last month's young leader's reception at Buckingham Palace. The former Suits actress was today dressed in a black Dior gown which sat off her shoulders, another way in which Meghan has broke royal protocol in her short time as a royal. At her wedding, she wore an off-the-shoulder gown and shortly afterwards, a blush pink gown of the same style to the Queen's Trooping the Color celebration. The style was deemed inappropriate as female members of the royal family tend to cover more flesh at public events. Meghan also broke royal protocol by going against tradition by giving a speech at her wedding, not wearing nude tights and spending Christmas with the Queen, before she married Prince Harry on May 19. She has also put on public displays of affection towards Prince Harry, by touching his hand and holding it, which is behavior rarely seen by the royal family.